All right, got that item. And it's daytime. I did not go up here. Humor's ruins. A treasure chest there. Killer gear. Perfume bottle. Oh, hello. Bye bye. Perfumer's cookbook. make this shit look so easy. I feel like where I am right now is kind of a little bit ahead of her, of uh, where, I sh where I should be. Like, like I'm, I'm pretty strong compared to this area. Cause I've, I've had this area unlocked for a while. I just didn't want to go to it. And my gear is also upgraded, so that helps a lot. Nascent butterfly. Another perfume bottle? I've also played these games. I've played all the Souls games, all this, the, every game in the series, and I've, I'm, I play a lot of action games. So learning, learning enemy patterns and all that kind of stuff is something that's just natural for me. I'm used, to, I'm used to it. I have a lot of experience with these kinds of games. Budding cave moss. Neat. Top my health off. Oh, that's not my health. Top my health off real quick. There's a lot of poison over here, man. A lot of dank away. Put on the lantern. Gold firefly. Cool. That's a cave? What the fuck? Sage's cave? I'm just finding caves, man. I'm just finding a, a bajillion caves, bro. Hold on. That, do that, that, that. There we go. I keep finding caves all over the fucking place, dude. It's ridiculous, man. There we go. Alright. Let's keep going. Oh good. It's a is it it's a hidden wall cave? There's gonna be a bunch of hidden walls here. These are bones. I gotta use these. Lost Ashes of War. Rejuvenating boluses? Boluses.
Ooh. Oh my god, that's a lot of treasure. Silver pickle, foul foot. Give me five of those. Black hood. Candle tree wooden shield. Ace and butterfly. Anything else around here? Any other weird secrets on these walls? Okay. in this dungeon. We have a lot of HP. Oh my god. Stone sword key, hey. Cool. Dragon wound grease. Raptor talons. Ooh. I'll have to look at all this stuff when we finish this place. Golden great arrow. Just finding new stuff, man. Oh no! Don't no no. no. <laughs> More treasure ch Raptor's black feathers. Skeletal mask. Okay, I, I, that's a boss room. That's an- what? Be wary of stuff. I'm gonna go over here. Necromancer Garrett. Ow. Oh. Oh. found one boss um Oh, good.
God, I hate this fucking boss. That is so annoying. Alright, well, I'll have a lot of healing for, the, for when I actually come back down here. I, th I I think I understand the uh, the whole revenge thing that from when I fought this thing the first time in a different area. Can I jump down here. Ooh, I don't know about that. Bother, I can't even see shit down there, man. I'll just run. Okay. That's so stupid. What? Okay. Ceiling Veil. I didn't pick up my runes. <laughs> Maybe it's Death Blight build up. Oh, okay. I didn't actually read Night Comet. Fires a semi invisible magic comet. The sorcery can be cast repeatedly while in motion, charging enhances potency. Two hand, two -hand the shield and charge forward while maintaining guard. Weaker enemies will be shoved backwards and can even be staggered. Hold to extend the duration of the charge force. Claw comprised of two sharp, thin blades wielded by the assassins of Ravenous. Of, uh, Ravenous. This weapon allows them to uh, to imitate the attacks of death birds. 
Besides excelling at airborne attacks, its charge attack mimics the vicious swoop of a bird of prey. Three bludgeoning copper heads attached to a handle by chains. Miniature weapon of, Nerc of Necromancer Garrus, the heretical sage. The heads were made to resemble those of his wife and two children. Ugh. Familial rancor? Gently rattle the copper heads to summon vengeful spirits that chase down foes. The anguish of a spouse and children invites a cursed wrath. Carved great arrows made together with the Erd Tree Great Bow deals holy damage. Lead with an oath sworn incantation which boosts the attack and defense of the archer and their nearby allies. Hmm. Small, medium sized wooden shield. Light for its size and easy to handle. Thought to represent a, super, uh, a, surrep a surreptitious prophecy of cardinal sin. Lit candle tree design was forbidden. Hood of lusterless black fabric that conceals its wearer's identity. In this world, there is very little that must ne that must necessarily be known. Skeletal mask that tightly grips the face, worn by the assassins of Ravenmouth. This ritual implement relentlessly digs uh, into the wearer's face, preserving one's human instincts while dressed in imitation of the death birds. Oh, I didn't read Omen Killer stuff. Robe worn by the Omen Killers, butchers of twisted conscience. Its thick apron is worn in remembrance of Rollo, progenitor of the Omen Killers and perfumer of antiquity. Robe crafted with the black feathers of a bird of prey, worn by the assassins of Ravenmouth. Ritual implement or transforming into a death bird, if only by imitation. Strengthens jump attacks. We are birds of prey, bringers of death. Talisman put together from dark cloth with lustrous sheen. Completely conceals the wearer's presence while crouching at a distance from foes. Part of one of the concealing veils used by the assassins on the Night of the Black Knives. Hmm. Cool. I like the music when you're fighting the, the, the assassins. I still have not gotten the dang map for this place. Let me go use my, my runes. Thirty endurance, I guess we could work on. I suppose. A little more stamina don't hurt. So many plants. So many plants and I don't know where I'm going. Wait, what is that? I think the setting stone. What the fuck? <laughs> scared the shit out of me, man. queue up. Oops. 
Not my trusty lantern. Alright. I guess we'll go up then. There's no music, there's no ambiance, it's just... Me left with my devices. What the, is a fucking item up here? Folger Bloom. Cool. Buffering system is why. Does restarting the game do like fix that? I just quit in the main menu and that's about it. Oh, hello. Uh oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, it's a wave. I really hate whenever I press the button to dodge and it's either mistimed and then makes me dodge or I just don't dodge. But at least I don't have to worry about my runes because I leveled. Oh, I spawned in front of an item. That's nice. Ruler's mask and robe. Oh, there we go. Oh, well, dying fixed it. Do I have Bloodhound step? Honestly, I keep forgetting it exists. I'm not gonna lie to you. Don't zap my runes! Thank you. Ow, I'm dead. I have 9,000. I literally have not used that special ability at all since I got it. I'm gonna use it when I, when I respawn, because I wanna see. I wanna see what it does. Let's see. Oh, okay. I see. That's cool. Oh, that's got a big range. Oh. Ah! <laughs> oh, he's out of here. See anything up here? Oh. I gotta check the ruler gear description.
Luxurious robe worn by lords in a smaller nation. Its fine blue mantle serves to prove its wearer's status. Mask and the image of a wizened sage. Customary dress among lords in a smaller nation. This increases faith. Such a mask illustrates the qualities of an ideal lord, chiefly wise and possessing a certain defanged geniality. One at the center of society. One at the center of society often finds these qualities most expedient. Where in the world am I right now? Holy fuck. Oh! That's what that connects to. That's cool. Well, I found out my answer. The, f the beast eye quivers. Hey! There's the, the, the boatman. The mariner. Yes! Yeah. What the fuck? No! What the fuck? Where'd that boatman, where'd, where'd the boatman go? These enemies aren't a part of the boss. Oh, I thought you were dead. There we go. the wrong button. Oh, my frame rate. Hey. Oh. And it's curved sword. I just killed an enemy and got that. <laughs> killed the stone, a stone boy, or a, a bone boy. Bone lad.
Pearl Drake Talisman? Plus one. I don't even have the first one. Greatly boosts non-physical damage negation. Talisman depicting a duo of pearlescent ancient dragons. Greatly boosts non-physical damage negation. Ancient dragons who ruled in the prehistoric era before the Earth Tree. Yeah, same thing as before. I got new... What else did I get? There it is. Summons a group of those lost in death. Three skeletons will appear some distance from the caster and attack foes uh, before disappearing. The dead of villain will live to wander. What, what they need is the <laughs> Okay. Then I got a couple new things here. Curved sword with a light crescent shaped blade used by the bandits who ran rampant in the wake of the shattering. Most of the blade is now darkened and covered in rust. But with enough dexterity, this weapon may still stand up uh, to some use. and C scaling. Oh. Alright, green. Shield of Honor depicting a city crowned by the sun. It has seen better days. Much like the wearer upon the shield, the seat of the sun has long faded away. What a cool shield. Sacramental bud. Don't see anything up here. Oh. That pulled the white cured meat. What the fuck does a dungeon. What? Windham Catacombs? Windham? <sighs> I'm finding so many fucking dungeons. Cool. The door is right up ahead, so that's cool. Get a trap. Does this do? Oh, that does a lot more damage. Even though bleed still procs and all that, I like I like seeing the health bar just chunk instead. What's a knight doing here? Oh!
painful expert and feel like your party had no idea what they were doing. Yeah. Yeah, that happens. I've definitely been there. Fucking imp, bro. Lightning scorpion charm? A talisman carried by assassins who strike unseen. Pattern on the on a scorpion freshly shed of its exoskeleton. Its claws seizing a heart that sparks with lightning. It has lightning attack power but lowers damage negation? Huh. Dell Knight Helmet. Hey. Uh, where is that helmet? Helm worn by knights sworn to defend the royal capital of Landell. The golden canopy represents the honor of standing among the tree's defenders. Cool. So we got that. This is the area that's on the other side. Alright. Oh my god. Oh my god. Open the door. <laughs> Holy Jesus. hit each other. Bobby, open the door. <laughs> Be he ass. Oh. Boy, we're gonna try and go for the hug. I go for the hug. Oh, the items. Thank you. What the fuck is it? Oh, there it is. <sighs> Me out of here. I still have another area to check. Pit. Let us return back to the surface. I have 
two. Yeah, I'll go back and heal real quick, because it's right there. Just refresh everything. Forty-six K. Again? Oh no. Jesse's favorite boss. Oh, got a uh, another bearing. I haven't gotten one in a while. I don't know, man. Some of these bosses aren't really like that crazy, but you know, everyone's different. So people don't find I don't find some of this shit difficult or annoying in some cases, and some people find the opposite. So even without, even if I wasn't using bleed. I've I've uh, understood like how the how their patterns and shit work, so I don't find it to be too crazy. I, the 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 one where you fight two of them, like the caster and the the one with the swordsman, uh, the, the, yeah, the swordsman. That one I have definitely done, and that's all they kept fucking doing was just just jumping and slamming their swords into the ground. I was like, well, this is stupid. Where the fuck Mount Gelmir? What? What? Where the fuck? Oh no. Okay. Barrage. Yeah, I have I have seen that place, man. They did this was mentioned in an item. It's true. I don't want to go over here just yet. I want to like explore up here more. Like, yeah, I'll just do this. Where's the map? Where the hell is the damn map? Help! Where am I? <laughs> 